say hello so welcome to another set of disney vlogs with a toddler shepherd hello guys welcome back to our channel welcome to another set of disney vlogs we are saying hey from the car at 3 37 a.m in the morning if you followed us on instagram you know that for this trip however far in the future it is that you're actually seeing this we decided that we would drive for our trip in march with we're the yeah with the toddler because i don't know we just decided that we were going to drive because we are not just going to Disney we are driving down to Sarasota because if you know our friend promise she's getting married and of course we're going to her wedding so we were gonna need our car anyway so we just decided to drive so we wouldn't have to rent one Shepard did great the majority of the way we are a little less than halfway and it's 3 37 in the morning we left at 9 50 9 30 ish from our house <laughs> and he slept most of the way until we got right to Bucky's if you ever drive from Louisiana or Texas or anywhere like in that area you drive through a part of Alabama that has a Bucky's and we actually started one of our Disney World vlogs here before <laughs> sitting right over there in the parking lot not only are we Disney people but we're definitely Bucky's we love Bucky's Shepard has woken up from his little power nap yeah and he's got all the energy in the world at 3 30 in the morning I have driven thus far and Jared is taking over from here because I am so tired tell you what if you ever want to go to a party in the middle of the night just find you a bucky's because that place was packed inside even at 3 a.m so are you going to drive the rest of the way <laughs> yeah yeah okay we'll see you there Welcome to Disney World, and most importantly right now, welcome to Wilderness Lodge. Our home. We love Wilderness Lodge so much, and we thought a perfect way to start out our new Disney vlogs than to take a, ooh, I almost ran over a lizard, <laughs> take a trip to Wilderness Lodge. We're DVC members, and this is our home resort. However, we're not staying at Wilderness Lodge this time. We're not even staying on Disney property this time for the first time. Which is really weird. Ever. We'll go into that story tonight, but we are going to run through Wilderness Lodge just to have a quick welcome home moment. We're gonna hop on the boat <laughs> and we're gonna head over to Magic Kingdom. So one of Jared's cousins is really big into Disney just like we are and they come a bunch and of all the trips that they've gone on and the ones that we've gone on our trips have never aligned. Well today is the only day during our trip and during her trip that we're both going to be here at the same time. So we're about to go meet up with Jared's cousin. Her name's Amber and her husband's name is Caleb. We're going to hang out with them for a lot of the evening. The rest of the evening we'll see. They live far away from us so they don't get to see Shepard very often. Hey, Caleb. Hey. Hey, Caleb. Hey. Fancy seeing y'all. So weird. It's so weird that we're both here at the same First time. Y'all know it's not the beginning of a Magic Kingdom or Disney trip in general without stopping at Casey's first. So we, of course, got Casey's. It is boiling hot outside, so we are headed to Pecosville, we're, we're like always. Eating we're not, not eating all the hot grass. We're going to Pecosville because it is burning up. Let's get through Adventureland. So Jerry got a chili cheese dog, and I, of course, got 
corn dog nuggets. I'm so excited. This is our first time eating like all day since like 5 a.m. Oh so. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Shepard's so hungry. He's going to eat these fries. It is so hot. I was not prepared for this weather. I didn't pack for this weather. I really thought it was gonna be in like the 70s, 60s. It's basically in the 90s today. So I'm not prepared for this mentally or, but I am like clothes wise, but. So we just got done eating at Pecos Bill. We are over here at Splash Mountain. We're gonna let Shepard get some wiggles out cause he's been in the car. He's been in his stroller. So we're gonna take him down here. There is a little play area for kids and we're gonna let him run around and play for a little bit. And we just discovered he is a fan of corn dog nuggets too. Yes, Shepard tried corn dog nuggets the first time so he had cases for the first time and he ate half a pint so now I'm gonna have to start ordering two you okay if you want more you come out here what you want more Hey, where are you going? We did so good in Carousel of Progress. 
Because I was really worried that he was going to want to like get down and run yeah. around. Because he's super, super active and he wants to basically run all the time. Huh? Because I'm a busy baby. Because I'm a busy baby. He likes the dog. He likes the dog. <laughs> Every time he came around, dog? No. Anyways, but he stayed and he watched every bit of it. I don't know what we're gonna do now, but I think we're we might go to the baby care center and just try to continue to let him cool off because he's still super super hot. Um, and try to nurse him because he was he was a little distracted in there. But it's a great place to nurse if you're a nursing mama. But Shepherd is he's too distracted. So we're gonna go to the baby care center and see if we can hang out with him for a little bit. Maybe cool off. Hey baby. Jeffy, you ready to go spinning? I'm a good spinner, huh? <laughs> not that we just ate her or anything. <laughs> I'm not scared of nothing. You get up to everything. <laughs> Shepard's like, oh, this is my time, right? Shepard's gonna fall asleep on the peacock. Oh, yeah. Oh, my baby. So did we discover a new firework viewing area? They have this open so the back pathway like they used to have open for the parties is open right now to minimize the crowd on Main Street and like through little branches on Main Street. And you can see the castle like perfect. It looks so good. The sky is open. There's nothing in the yeah, way. There's no, there's no obstruction. Yeah. Considering it's 15 minutes till showtime, I mean, it's, yeah. it's Look pretty at all good. This room. Shepard's trying to escape. Yep. So he can run hey, what are you doing? Are you excited to see the fireworks? <laughs> There's a tree in your way. Last time I watched fireworks, he went to sleep. Yeah, and then the time here was there was somebody in the bushes. In front of us. <laughs> My good friend, so far, you close enough to feel. just from our travel day here. Um, so we are gonna head back to the hotel and we're gonna get baths and relax. We will touch base with you there because we got, we'll explain to you what happened or why we're not sitting on property. And so we'll see you back at the room. Hey y'all, it's the next morning. We just realized that we came into our room and we just absolutely went to a crash. <laughs> so we drove that 12 hours that turned into like 13, 14, however many hours. We left our house at nine, 30 p.m. and we got to Orlando at 12 and it was a good definitely a good drive but we were very very tired Shepard was exhausted because he doesn't sleep well in the car so he slept for about six of the hours collectively and was awake for collectively about <laughs> eight of them so he was very very tired last night baby hi 
Hey. 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 So when we were coming to Florida, Shepard loves to say hey, so you're gonna hear 15 hey's in the background. So this trip was a very quick trip. Initially, we were coming to Florida. We were just going to Orlando for like a quick trip to Disney, just running in and out, because the main reason we were here was because we're going to our friend Promise's wedding. And she is getting married two hours outside of Orlando. And we were like, well, since we're already here, we're just gonna go to Disney too. We decided to take our car for multiple reasons because we were originally staying with my friend Tiffany and so we wanted to have our own car and we have Shepard and we wanted, didn't want to have his car seat. It was just it was just a lot easier to drive. We also had some friends that were coming in from out of town who needed a ride who didn't feel comfortable driving because um, they're they're not from here. They're from England. Uh, we were like yes great we love y'all we will be happy to pick y'all up and take you. So they were gonna stay here for two weeks and they were here for a week and they had some horrible news and they had to go back to England and um, we we're just super upset for them. So they're really upset that they're, they're missing Promise's wedding but more upset about everything that's happening back home. Yeah. So long story short was they had booked this hotel room for two weeks and the, they booked a package and the resort would not give them a refund for the second week and they were extremely gracious and kind and we're like well this room is just going to be sitting here empty we're not going to use it we have a whole week left they're like y'all want it and we were like uh, yes, we have a crazy toddler. We won't have to be in somebody else's house. Even though it was just Tiffany, she doesn't care. But anyways, that's a long story short of why we're not staying with Tiffany, why our plans changed, even though you didn't know what our plans were beginning. Those were our plans. It was crazy um, yesterday. We got here and it's like everything felt instantly so much, different. Yeah, everything changed. It was so strange. Um, but we were super thankful. We are still, but we're very sad because of what's happening with them. We uh, are definitely thankful that we were able to stay here and Shepard has a space to run and play and we're not worried about him being in someone else's house breaking everything. I realized um, exactly how much stuff we brought whenever we moved it all into this Yes, hotel I was room. like, there was no <laughs> way we would have survived in a tiny bedroom at <laughs> Tiffany's house. But we're here, we're actually staying on basically universal, universal property. Yeah. So I'm, it's the closest I'm I've ever sitting been and I'm looking at that Endless Summer Resort from Universal. So that is literally outside of our window right now. So there's the Endless Summer Resort resort from Universal. <laughs> there's Applebee's. There's another hotel right here. There's a twisty treat right there. Like we're super, super close to everything. Right outside, I guess like right over here, there's, there's the volcano and you can see everything. <laughs> yeah, we're really, really close to Universal. We've never been to Universal. I've been twice, but I've never been like with all the Harry Potter stuff, which is the reason I would want to go now, but we've never been to Universal together. Jared's never been at all. And um, so we've never been in this part of this area. We've never stayed over here. We've never driven over here. We've had no need. So it's interesting. I'm, gl I'm glad for things like this, like when we stay places like this, because we get to Otherwise explore. We yeah, we get to explore <laughs> a whole new place. And since we have our car, we can like just drive and go get some ice cream at Twisty Treat. <laughs> so we've never been there either, but Josh and Joey, our friends are like obsessed with that place. So anyways, I'm gonna hate editing in this because I'm talking way too much. But anyways, I just wanted to end the vlog here and let you know like what was going on and why we're staying in a just a regular hotel while we're not on Disney property or while we're not at a friend's house. It was just a really spur of the moment crazy like, hey. situation. Alright guys, we're gonna end the vlog here. Thank you so much for watching. Our first day was crazy. We were super, <laughs> super tired. Uh, I also didn't have the camera out a lot because yesterday I you have watched our channel for a long time you know that i have a really bad sun allergy i'm allergic to the sun and my face was having a i think that was the worst flare i've ever seen you have it was having a really hard time yesterday i mean it was it was on fire i couldn't wear makeup ever it was just my face hurt so bad yesterday and so i was not in the best mood because i was extra tired i was in a lot of pain and my face looked horrible i couldn't put makeup over i tried to put makeup over it twice and it looked like i was literally putting makeup over a dinosaur like fish scales or dinosaur scales like it was so bad so i didn't have the camera on light yesterday because i was self-conscious and i was in a lot of pain so Today really feels like a refresh, even though we're not even going to the parks today. Today is uh, today's today. still going to be really different yeah, because so. we've got to drive two hours. You'll see that in our next vlog. Thank you so much for watching this one, even though it was crazy and all over the place. We love you, and we will see you in our next one. Bye. Bye.